Hello my friends. Today I started the disassembly of the quadrant. Uh, it took me I think two hours to get uh, to this stage here and I'm still not finished. Um, I was able to remove the trim wheels, the um, side covers, some covers over here. I cut the steel cables and now I'm trying, uh, or maybe tomorrow or the next days, I'm trying to remove this white bottom piece here because this has been uh, cut out of the aircraft and this is uh, annoying me here because it's, it's not level, you can see it. And uh, I just have to get rid of it, but I think these are some rivets here and um, I'm not sure how to remove them. But uh, probably I have to use some grinder or something. Um, the condition of the throttle, of course, is used, but I never imagined that I will find so much dust and dirt inside. I wonder, ah, yeah, look here. Uh, I wonder if these uh, throttle quadrants are disassembled during some major checks of the aircraft, but it seems not. Um, well, but uh, okay, so I need some, probably some air pressure to uh, remove the dust and um, I will try to uh, disassemble it completely and um, clean all the parts. Uh, I think the inner parts do not need some new painting, just the outside parts, um, but maybe some lubrication. Um, I also will try to keep the wiring as it is, the wiring is perfect and um, I just need to figure out the, the uh, the routing or the root, the root of the cables, yeah, because yeah, they're coming out here with these bus connectors, and um, so let's see. I have to make some new connectors. I'm sure because I do not have the the um, counterparts to them. Um, so wiring should not be a problem, um, but uh, I think uh, the task of uh, a throttle conversion to use it in a simulator is is not the wiring the task is uh, and the challenge is to uh, get some mechanic working and uh, I will uh, go for a uh, open cockpits um, you a DC motor plus card and uh, some DC motors and some servos for the uh, speed brake and uh, then we will see but uh, I think it will take a lot of time okay thanks for watching and um, goodbye